Hello, hello, hello! Welcome back to more Life is Strange Before the Storm. And here we are! Do you remember in the last episode, Rachel and Chloe kissed? So now we go into Rachel's house to get some clothes. Exciting! And I think Rachel mentioned something about getting away from Arcadia Bay tonight. So, yeah, I don't know what about you, but I'm really excited about doing that. Ah, oh, that's Rachel's mum. She's got a nice house. An open plan kitchen. This is going to be like, are we going to be sneaking by her mum? Okay. <laughs> oh, I'm still like, can't get over the fact that they kissed. Because, you know, before playing... Ah, oh, okay. Oh, you're home. Hey, Dad. All right. That's about sneaking. No more sneaking for us. Rose, Rachel's home. Oh. So... And she um, brought her new friend. Everyone knows Rachel's home now. Our surprise Hi. star returns. You're just in time. Did Dinner's they... almost ready. Did they come for the performance? Chloe, was it? Yeah, it was. It is. It was. It is. Nailed it. I must have been pretty memorable. Oh, you were. Nonsense. I get the sense that you're used to making an impression. <laughs> Rachel, honey, you were resplendent tonight. Ah, you're Thanks. right. They came for the play. I feel so sad. You must join us ah, for yeah. dinner tonight. Uh, okay, I forgot. She must. I must. Of course. Sorry. I made chicken a la king. <gasps> I'm sure you both acted up quite the appetite. Chicken a la king. Not hungry. Just leaving. Just leaving. Thanks, but I, I was just going to stop and in bounce. for a sec and then bounce. <laughs> oh, what did a, you have other dinner plans? What a vocabulary. Dinner plans? I always thought dinner was something that just sort of happens. Chloe, Chloe I Chloe, know Chloe. we didn't exactly meet each other at our best this morning, but with you and Rachel becoming wow, such fast the same friends, day. I insist you join us for dinner. Don't you agree, Rachel? Oh. Yes, of course. Chloe, would you join us for dinner, please? Uh, of course. Great. So we're not leaving. I just need to wash off. Then I'll be right down. Don't be long. In meantime, perhaps you can help me with the table, Chloe? Yeah, of course. I'm sure really good thing, with it. Mrs. Amber. <laughs> so much about running away. Okay, I'm gonna go pack. After dinner, we can make our break. You cool down here? Oh well. Um totally. Let's let's play. It. Totally. <laughs> your parents love me. Uh, They're good at Maybe they will. Way, but don't let your guard down. And what are you trying we, to say, Rachel? We just need to make it through dinner. Try not to say anything that, you know, that I would normally say. I'm exactly. going to say that Chloe is in well behaved. Just some quality time with the Amber. <laughs> What could possibly go wrong? Ah, I think we're going to have a great time. Look. Huh. Oh, boy. Rachel really was an overachiever before she met me. Don't know what it means. In the bud. I don't think they go together. Okay, where is the... We need to get the message. Message. You get medals for two good deeds today drew's okay mikey will text you an update in the middle oh shit tell them both i'm pulling for them what uh why is this more <laughs> um thank you for what you did you helped on to mikey he told me it meant a lot to him i heard you were in a tempest yeah it was kind of a big deal uh i believe it everyone says the show was awesome ah that's how it goes you know, I feel bad because uh, the thing wasn't awesome. Uh, you know, we all know <laughs> I was there to take the money. I'm not sure what to think. Recliner. Ooh, let's sit down the recliner. Is it going to recline? Oh, is it, are Rachel parents going to take tell me up? So this is what normal looks like. It's yeah. Okay. I like how he like didn't even look at me. He's just reading the paper. Computer. Can we use his computer without asking? I mean, that's mean. Uh, look at the file. Yeah, oh, look. Shit. Oh. 
That's the guy who attacked Drew. Oh, look, that's, there's a lady. holding onto a grand of his Sarah money. Sarah Gahart. Rachel and I couldn't be leaving town soon enough. Whoa. Sheldon Pike, Peter Gilbside, Rodney van der Sears, and Francis Bowers, Damon Merrick. You know, it's funny. <laughs> Do you see the Rodney van der Sears? Um, I watched a lot of like videos, everything wrong with Life is Strange Before the Storm, episode one. And everyone was saying that he looks like Jonah from Tomb Raider. I mean, I didn't see it, but then I don't exactly see it, but I saw like two videos saying I, I thought it was funny. Um, because I was saying, some families oh. actually go to Paris instead of just talk about it their whole lives. Oh, your mom wants to go to Paris. I've been to Paris. Uh, it's very beautiful. My flatmate really likes Paris. My flatmate can also speak French, so it's a little bit different. Easy to see who wears the literary pants around here. Was it Legal Digest, The Divine Comedy, Bleak House? Well, Chloe, I'm sure you could be into arts if you wanted to, but it's not your thing. They say it's okay. all news is local. Fire grows despite interagency yeah. efforts. Largest fire in Acadia history frightens residents and baffles authorities. You know, is it like some kind of, um, a, you know, not literal meaning? Because it's a symbol, isn't it, for Rachel's anger? Let's speak to him. Oh, look, they have Rocco painting. They have a lot of money. What can I do for you? Uh, Jessica, tell me, Rachel, the play, gotta go, the play, did you what like do it? What you think? I thought Rachel was perfectly cast. She certainly was. We're very proud of her. I had no idea they were going to do that. Do what? Yeah, exactly. I don't know the name for it. Uh, reverse, reverse casting? Casting a, a woman as a man? Ah. Uh, I just meant the wizard part. Ah. <laughs> uh, I suppose that's also true. <laughs> oh, Rachel. Let's ask Your about Rachel. Great. Thank you. We're fond of her as well. Aww. You ever feel like she's very so sweet. awesome at everything that you just want to shake her? No. <laughs> no, he doesn't. Yeah. Sorry, I would check my microphone. Uh, me neither. It's good. <laughs> that was a bit too much honest here. Sorry, I'm looking at myself because I'm checking if the microphone isn't touching the hair. So like I move away the hair. Okay, we're going back. District attorney, gotta go. District attorney. Let's let's so, just finish this awkward you're conversation. District attorney, huh? Ah, uh, yeah. Your district attorney. <laughs> so I can call you if I'm ever district arrested. Oh, Clay. What would you be arrested for? <laughs> it's a very good question. It was a joke. Not a good one. Clearly. No, it was not a good joke. Duty calls. Duty. Good, good chat. Look at him. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. He, he loves me. I can just tell it went very well. Um, can we press the security alarm here? No, I didn't think so. Flowers. God, it was flowers. And that was not the flowers. My parents used to have a vase like that in their house, but they put like a peacock feathers in there. Somehow it's quite popular in Poland to put peacock feathers into vases. Let's look at another painting. Oh, I think that's an original who gives a shit. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm more of a science person, aren't you? I think so. Crossword puzzle, improve look. Look. What the Amber family considers entertainment looks a lot like what I consider. I really humor. like crosswords. I'm really shit in it. But you know, like the more you do, the better you actually become in them. News article. What's the news article about? Something about, about this photo. D. A. James Amber cracks right. down on drags. I should fix it. Really? We're going to like graffiti inside the Rachel's house. I mean, her mom is looking away, but, oh, look at the eggs. They say eggs, the chicken. Okay, let's graffiti this thing, because I'm just curious. This. Rachel's mom is right there. She oh, totally okay, I felt like the game is really bad. All right, let's check to Rachel's mom. Hey there, Mrs. Amber. Ah, Chloe, 
I'm so glad you're joining us. You tonight. are? Rachel. So, uh, Rachel was pretty awesome. She's pretty right? awesome all the time. She sure was. And I imagine whatever trick the two of you pulled to get her back on stage was even more dramatic than the play. Yeah, it you was. Can be very, uh, <laughs> that was really well said. Together. Persuasive. Yes, that's a word for it. <laughs> I get the very sense sweet. that you're a force of nature yourself. I can see why the two of you get along so well. Force of nature. You can? Because it still seems crazy to me. I think Chloe's a little bit too honest. But whatever. Yeah, what did you think of the play? Rachel was typically amazing. Oh. But I never liked The Tempest. What did you think of it? Oh, to you knew be honest, it I only really read a couple pages. Theater's not really my thing. Yeah. I guess I'm not so into saying words someone else came up with. Oh, wow. Fair point. Then again. I'm not sure you can judge the entire art form based on the dead white men your curriculum focuses on. Oh. Damn. <laughs> Shots fired, Shakespeare. <laughs> She's a feminist. I like her. Setting the table, Mr. Amber. Mr. Amber. Integrity, honesty, loyalty. Yes. What? <laughs> it's on your lawn. <laughs> ah, oh, yeah, right, right, outside. Sorry. I guess I'm still getting used to being an elected official's wife. Yeah, strong words, married life, strong, strong words, married life, it's a Those bit. Those are some strong words. Yeah, I'm going to have a sip you of my he tea. Lives up to them? He's fantastic at what he does. Of course, he's only human. Or subhuman. Oh no. What? Why did you I say that? Said something. Yeah, no, nope. I, oh wow. Okay, let's just set the table, so, Chloe. Are you putting me to work or what? Yes. If you could please take four plates from the cupboard and set them on the table. I and mean, what if I can't? Excuse me? <laughs> you said if I could. Chloe, you're not funny. Never mind. I mean, in England, it would be considered like you're pretty right, rude. Chloe. <laughs> Chloe. This lady is so British. You set the table with yeah, right. someone's marriage before. Piece of cake. Yeah, let's just set up the table for now, before Rachel's parents will hate me. Nick. Everything about this house is nicer, cleaner, better, and more expensive oh, okay. than mine. Look, cabinet. Which isn't saying much. Um, she said I should set the table, but where do I find plates? Speak. Yes. Uh, huh? How am I doing? <laughs> so, am I crushing it? This dinner would be taking literally minutes longer without you. Oh, wow. Her Crushing parents it. love me. Her parents need to come to England. They will get along with people so well. Sink. So clean. I bet Rose would kill it with my mom at the diner. Ah. Open. I can look into her cabinet. It's not a bit rude. No skeletons. Lots of shiny dishes, though. Okay. Mikey, Mikey. Uh, what did Mikey say? Forget it? No, that's not all. Hey, Chloe, Drew is out of surgery. Holy oh, shit, Mikey, I'm so sorry. It's okay, you stuck with me. Wish I could have helped more. Hey, Steph says you were in the play. What? Uh, I had a busy day. Most of your. Oh. Okay. Um, I feel bad. I feel bad. I wonder what will happen if. You don't take the money. Is there an option not to take the money? I think I'll have to research it. I don't know if I will go back and replay to see all of the options. Maybe I should take? Take what? Ah, yeah, we're setting the table. It's off to the table with you. Yeah. Rachel has a nice house. I really like the open plan kitchen. In my flat, we don't have an open plan kitchen. The room behind me, you see with the cat, that's the kitchen. Plates. And yeah, where I'm sitting is a living room. Mm-hmm. Mom. My mom. Yeah, like, well, Chloe, Justin Williams' mom called me. Were you in a play? I would have liked to see that. Kind of just happened. I know it was last minute. I'm glad you're doing well. It would be nice to see you tonight. Are you coming home? Please, Chloe, I miss you. 
Oh, it's nearly 11 p.m. And we are hanging around in Rachel's house <laughs> because her parents love me. Uh, look at the granddad. Damn. Wonder if this is a family heirloom. You think? Maybe. Oh, well, look at the painting. Is that Rachel? No, we won't find out. Cabinet. Open cabinet. Whoa, so shiny. Glasses. Damn. The ambers are fancy as shit. I mean, what, because they have glasses? Come on, let's not exaggerate, <laughs> Chloe. Never realized that getting drunk could be so complicated. Uh, you know, I don't know how it is, but like, um, back where I'm from, everyone have glasses like that in their house. Yes, it's not only no. fancy people. What's next? Plates? Check. Anything else? Actually, could you be a dear and ask Mr. Amber what he'd like to drink with dinner? Oh, Mr. Amber is I will be a dear. reading a paper Talking and Miss Amber is making the dinner. As long as I dinner. can avoid using the words cheating Classic. and scumbag, I should be fine. Oh, Chloe, it's not your dad. So it's kind of like, can he use his computer in front of him? You can! Oh my to god. Read about it afterwards. Hope uh, Drew's okay though. Oh. Congrats on the wonderful cast and crew of The Tempest. So sorry I messed up guys, emergency came up. Love you guys, I'm so sorry. Why sorry? You don't control the file, do you? Chloe held it down like a champ. Any update on how it's Drew doing? Recovering, we are still, we are going to see him first thing tomorrow. Hmm. How to clear browser history, followed by a gap for all of yesterday. That's like, Cheating ass hat 101. I mean, I don't understand. Why am I reading his things in front of him? But whatever. <laughs> He's not going to say anything? No, he didn't say anything. That's interesting. Something else? Yeah, a drink. What's your vice, Mr. Amber? What's your vice? I'm sorry? Yeah, I would be the wife same. wife wants to know what kind of drink you're having. Ah, let's say sherry. Ah, oh, sherry's okay. nice. Okay. One, two, three, sherry. Ah. Uh, Comical. <laughs> Chloe, I don't get it. Maybe you can help me understand something. Maybe. I'll give it a shot. Rose and I, we're worried about Rachel. Yesterday was so unlike her. Yeah? What do you suppose is going on? Uh, besides me, besides you. Uh, am I going to take it on me? Because it will sound like I'm making her besides you. Hard to say. Maybe she's rebelling against something. Or someone. What would Rachel have to rebel against? We've given her everything she could ask for. Yet mm. it seems you're right. Rachel's actions show that something in her has changed. Yeah. I'd be lying if I said I didn't have concerns about your friendship. <laughs> so upfront. Perhaps you're exactly who Rachel needs right now. I she mean, navigates the choppy uh, waters of adolescence. I, I, I think I. <laughs> I miss the uh, Britishness, indirectness. Thanks. I don't know, was that a compliment? I... I think so, in a way. <laughs> or whatever. Okay, let's tell her that it's all about Sherry. The chicken is... Yes, Chloe? Just as bloody, Sherry. The boss man would boss. like a Sherry. <laughs> Thank you. The glasses are in the china cabinet. You can place one at his setting. Where is How he am I sitting? supposed to get to China? Oh. Kidding. <laughs> <laughs> it's the fancy looking cabinet, right? Chloe, it. just stop it. Just stop it. I mean, she's making worse. Uh, take. Uh. It's the triangle shaped one. Yeah. How many? Basic shapes. <laughs> Now you're There are only two language. types, aren't there? Hmm. I wonder if I would know which one is for Sherry. You know, I used to be a bartender back in the days. I mean, 
I don't know why I'm laughing. I was quite okay in bartending. I was very, very bad as a waitress though. I used to be a waitress. <laughs> Sorry. I used to be a waitress in this five-star hotel. Like, I was preparing breakfast for the guests and sometimes I was working in the evening during banquets. And I mean, once I hit the guests on the yes. back of their heads with a tray. I mean, I was not good. What else? <laughs> feel like I'm getting good at this. Only one less Yeah, you're better than me, I think. Guest, you may do the honor of lighting the candles. Oh. The lighter is in the... It's cool. I've got my own. Oh, Chloe. Oh. You never know when you'll need to light a candle. That's right. Right? Yeah. You're a paragon of preparedness. Thanks. I'm not quite sure what it means. I think. Chloe. Time to light some candles. Oh, we can destroy the... This destroy. joint up a bit. Oh, 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 improve their crossword to make the ambas like me a little bit more. <laughs> literal literature. Uh, illiterate. Uh, literal. Sorry. <laughs> Clearly, I cannot read. What did you draw? Look, she's left handed. So. Oh. Okay. That was a bit harsh, but. It, it's not the first life is strange. We cannot turn back time. So we'll just make with it. Light the candles. The dinner will start soon. The pleasantries with Ambers are nearly finished. The Amber family and fire. What could possibly oh, go wrong? No idea. <laughs> Sorry, the game's a bit literal. Oh, Rachel is down. Did she bring any clothes for me too? I'm kind of like happy to get changed. I don't like this blue bee anymore. It's quarter to 11. So, Chloe, are you and Rachel in any of the same classes? No, not anymore. I, I wish. I wish. Rachel's all honors. I'm still trying to get into remedial... Chloe. Vocabulary. What about that fire? <laughs> yeah, what about it? <clears throat> Dinner's really good, Mom. Thank you, Rachel. <laughs> the way the fire spreads so fast, I've never heard of anything like it. Really? It's a, an anger from your daughter's heart. It's scary, it's strange. It's scary. Yeah, it's scary. Rachel, you don't After have anything to say about this fire? I was overjoyed we had less rain this year. Who knew a spring drought could be even more dangerous? Oh, the conversation is so British. You never know where a deadly spark will come from. Mm, it's yeah. certainly troubling. The latest report from the commissioner's office suggests arson. Arson? Why would anyone do that? Any number of reasons. Arson. With everything going on in the world today, what does it mean, arson? Like I need to Hill like look it up. Immune to the ills of society. Immune to ills of society. I cannot imagine how difficult these last few years have been for you, Chloe. Now that you and Rachel have become friends, Aww. I want you to know that our home is really? always open to you. How sweet is this? Cool. Thanks, Chloe. Well you better said, not mess dear. it up. It's imperative in such troubled times as these that we remember what is most important to us. And what is that? Family. Oh. Family's not merely a gift. It is a responsibility. Oh, Rachel. <laughs> as such, She's getting triggered, huh? Be cared for and never, Do you think she has some kind of powers? Forgotten. Come, Rachel. Attack James. Come, Rachel. I'm not going to be attacking her dad. Uh, yeah, that's super true. And also remember, Rachel, that even when shit's like the lamest ever, we can <laughs> always run away this? from whatever's bothering you. As long as you just keep calm. Oh wow, she's getting an, an attacking interesting moment. Interesting philosophy, Chloe. <laughs> yes, indeed. Not one that I would endorse, however. <laughs> I favor confronting my problems head. Oh wow. But to each their own, I suppose. <laughs> oh, fucking blow me. Rachel, what? explain this track. Is this track? I mean, Rachel oh, can. Crap! I'm so clumsy. I mean, Rachel, Rachel can do it herself can if she you wants. Come help me find another Stop fork, it. Chloe. 
I can't sit here and listen to this bullshit anymore. Rachel! Stop it, Dad. You're a hypocrite. Okay? I know. What do you know? You lying, cheating piece of shit, motherfucker. Excuse oh. me? <laughs> we saw you <laughs> yesterday at the Overlook. James? Kissing that woman. James. Rachel? She's not Honey, upset, is she? Whatever you saw or think you saw, I know it's hard. But I need you to trust me. What do you mean? Trust you think we saw. Think we saw? Think we saw? Are you trying to gaslight us? There's no I mean... thinking involved. We saw you locking lips with another woman. <laughs> That's lips. enough. <gasps> you are not welcome here or around my daughter any longer. I was trying I so exactly hard. What kind of person you are from the moment I saw you. And I let my wife's compassion get the better of you. Oh? What kind of person is a that? A delinquent. A Aww. broken girl from a broken home. Yeah, well, that's enough, James. That's a bit I mean. Not have you continue to speak to her like this. Oh my god, Chloe, did you actually like start to argue with them? What is she saying? Rachel, Rachel. Rich is going to explode in your moment. Why can't you just tell me the <gasps> fucking truth? Oh my! Stop lying! Stop how, being a politician for one fucking minute! We can bask it! Break the table! Can't you just be my dad? Oh my! That Rachel, was like a... That woman you saw... It wasn't? It wasn't your mistress? It wasn't. But let's, sorry, let's go back to that table for a second. <laughs> what? So, her mother is not her mother? What? That doesn't make sense. But even if it's her mother, we saw him... Oh, and Chloe's not back. Sorry, Joyce. Joyce can change. She's not at work anymore. She's working so many shifts. Always with an apron. <laughs> oh, you know what I don't get? Why in America they wear shoes inside of their houses? I mean, like, in my house, you have to take off your shoes once you enter. Whoa, the fire is still on. And this is... Oh, Nathan. Why does she like Nathan? I mean, this guy, he's... Uh... Is he going to murder this one too? Because I don't remember, he murdered Rachel. I think he murdered Chloe in the original one. I need to remind myself. And this? What are those? Oh, ballerina, that's Rachel's mum. Well, you know, when you say that, she looks like Rachel. But, ah, okay, I was about to say, why is she there, like, in snow, in distress? But it's not a snow. It's the ash. Oh, That's the end of the episode, isn't it? Yeah. Aww. Oh, I enjoy this. I think I like this episode more than the episode one. It's really nice. Oh, yeah, that was good. So we have one more episode left. And <laughs> you know what well, I'm trying to conclude this. Um, the extra episode was released. So actually, I'm um, two episodes back. Um, 
so yeah that was that guys i hope you enjoyed it um thank you very much for watching and i see you next time bye guys i completely forgot we have the choices to look at so yeah here it is let's see how i did in brave new world uh you took the blame for rachel 79 percent and i was like no i'm not doing it you went along with rachel's story i did um you emptied your pockets at david's request 62 percent of people did that i can't believe it you refused to empty your pockets. You're dumb, right? <laughs> uh, you gave Damon the money, 35%. You stayed with Mikey. Okay. That makes me feel a little bit better. But still, that was like a really nasty choice to do. And you asked Rachel for a kiss, 72%. You asked Rachel to get the tattoo. You asked Rachel to give you her bracelet. Come on, does really someone ask for a tattoo? <laughs> And okay, that's that's the earlier one. You run, yeah, I did that. You told Rachel you're more than friends. Okay, that's this. Mm, Any more? No, that's this. Okay, so yeah, that was fun. Uh, it's interesting to see, especially the part about emptying the pockets. <laughs> but yeah, that was my choices. So again, guys, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.